What is an eSIM? Let me break it down for you in under two minutes. Whether you're using an iPhone or an Android device, understanding eSIM is essential. And today I'll show you exactly how it works, why is it important, and if you should start using one right now. eSIM stands for Embedded SIM. Unlike traditional SIM cards that you can physically remove and swap, an eSIM is built directly into your phone's motherboard. In other words, it's built directly into your phone's hardware. No plastic, no SIM card trays, and no swapping between physical SIM cards anymore. You activate an eSIM digitally by scanning a QR code provided by your eSIM provider, or by entering an activation code. And that's it, it's pretty straightforward. Now, you can store multiple eSIM profiles on your phone and switch freely between them in your phone's settings. This is a great option for travelers or people that have multiple SIM cards or multiple numbers in their devices. This is also great for separating work and personal lines. But in order for your eSIM to work on your iPhone or on your Android, you need to make sure that your device is eSIM compatible and network unlocked if you plan to use it with multiple carriers. If you don't know this about your device, there are quick and reliable online services that can safely and legally check your phone's eSIM compatibility and unlock your phone remotely. I will leave a link in the comments below for you to check that out if you need to. Now, these are the benefits of using eSIMs versus traditional SIM cards. To start with, you won't need to wait for your SIM card to be mailed over you and you will be able to instantly get it activated over the internet. eSIMs are also more secure. You can't lose them or clone them easily. On top of it, it saves physical space inside your device, making your phone thinner and more battery efficient. A huge benefit is convenience, especially if you're a traveler. Let's say you're traveling to Hawaii, you can simply purchase an eSIM and as soon as you land, your phone will be instantly activated and you will have data instantly, instead of having to look for shops that sell physical SIM cards at your destination. So this is a massive game changer. However, it's not all perfect for eSIMs. Still today, not all carriers support eSIMs yet, especially the small carriers. Also, some users might find initial setup a bit complicated. And if your phone breaks, you can't just pull a new SIM card and use another phone instantly. Unfortunately, you will have to request a new eSIM from your eSIM provider. If you travel often and want to manage multiple numbers or just prefer a cleaner setup, switching to an eSIM is a smart move. Just make sure that your phone is carrier unlocked and compatible with eSIMs. If you don't have an eSIM yet, you can use any provider, but I do recommend getting it from SIM Abroad. It's the most reliable service. They provide coverage in over 200 destinations and they even have an eSIM that is global. So you need to install it once and it supports over 138 countries. If this helped you, make sure to hit that subscribe button, like it, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.